Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to easily upgrade the RAM in your Dell G3. So when I was purchasing my laptop, I decided to go with eight gigabytes of RAM just to see how that would work, but it's been a little sluggish. So I decided to upgrade to 32 gigabytes. Now, when you're purchasing your RAM, there are a couple things you have to look for. I'll have a link to the description to the RAM that I'm using so that you can actually compare the specs and make sure that you're getting the correct RAM. But really the main thing is to ensure that it is SODIMM, which is a smaller version of RAM and 260 pins. So if you're trying to upgrade to 32 gigabytes, I do recommend this RAM and I'll have a link in the description to where you can get that. I got it for about $145, which I don't think is that bad. So when it comes to actually changing the RAM on your Dell G3, all you need to do is flip it over and then unscrew the screws on the back. There are 10 screws in total. And once you get those unscrewed, the back panel should just come off. So I'll do that now. And just a reminder, these are just Phillips head screws. So a normal screwdriver should work. All right, so I've loosened all 10 screws and all but two of them, the ones right here by the back panel, those actually will remain in the back section. You just need to loosen them. So once you get all the screws out, just go ahead and gently lift up on the panel. Once you get the back panel removed, the RAM will be right here. So the first thing I recommend doing just to ensure that there's no power going to anything is to go ahead and unhook the battery. And to do that, all you need to do is just pull back on this little tab right here next to the label battery. So now with the RAM to get it to loosen, all you need to do, see that little metal tab right there? Just put your nail and pull it back and it'll come undone like that. So we'll do that on both sides. Then the RAM should just flip up and come right out. As you can see, it says so dim only, and that's what I was discussing before. That's the size of it, 260 pins, and it does show you how to reinstall it. So we'll go ahead and get the other one out, and then I will add the new RAM. All right, so I have the RAM out, and I wanna show you real quick how you figure out if the RAM goes sitting face side up or down. So as you can see, the pins line up right there with that little line. So on this side, the RAM would be facing up, and then on this side, the RAM will be facing down. So it's very easy to see which way the RAM goes when you're installing it. You just have to be mindful to not force anything in and be careful. So I'm going to install the first set of RAM right here by just pushing it in. And then pushing it down. And it snapped in just like that. And now you can see those little teeth. They're sitting in place just like it was originally with the older RAM. Now I'll get the second piece of RAM installed. All right, so now the new RAM has been installed in my Dell G3. All I need to do now is simply reattach the battery and just put the panel back on. It should just snap right in. Shouldn't be too hard at all. Just apply a little bit of gentle force to it. And then you can just start putting the screws back in and tightening them up. Now you wanna remember not to put too much torque on these screws just until they're nice and snug. You don't wanna break the plastic or the body of the laptop. So when you turn your laptop back on, you will get a warning that the system memory has changed. All you need to do is select continue at the bottom and it'll continue through the boot process. That should be the only thing you have to do on the laptop once you've installed the RAM. So after that, you can simply just enjoy the extra RAM. So now when I open up my memory, you can see 32 gigabytes of RAM. A couple things to keep in mind, make sure that the RAM you get is 260 pin, so dim, that's the size, and check the description. I'll have links down there for 16 gigabytes and then 32 gigabytes of RAM that should be compatible with this laptop. Another thing to ensure you do is disconnect the battery before you replace the RAM, just so there's no way for it to short out. And then after the installation, when you're putting the back panel back on, remember not to tighten the screws too much because you might break the back panel. So that's how you upgrade the RAM in your Dell G3. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more tutorials, check the link in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.